Hello, fisherman in here. This video, I want to address again the issue with Tether. And I got a lot of private messaging asking me about the uh, problem with Tether. Is this uh, a fake coin? Uh, what's going to happen? Uh, is this going to bring down the entirety of the crypto space? And here's my take to it. First of all, I personally have never, ever used Tether, ever. I never trusted Tether from day one because I didn't see any uh, evidence that they actually are backed by anything tangible. And right now, anything they're publishing for me personally is questionable. However, I'm not nearly as bearish on Bitcoin prices just because Tether might not be the real thing. And let me explain to you why. First of all, Tether is just a liquidity provider. So when the liquidity provider goes away, traditionally you would think that the whole market will collapse upon itself. However, in this case, if majority of the participants in the market think that Tether is not good for the payment, so think about what are they going to do. Just imagine if I'm a big Tether holder, what would I do? If I think something's wrong with this uh, stablecoin, I want to get rid of it. So basically, Tether suddenly become an undesirable currency. So when that happens, the first step you're going to see that people are going to exchange their Tether for something else. So that means uh, the velocity of the money in the Tether space is going to increase. So normally people would, let's say, buy and sell Bitcoin with Tether from time to time. But once you realize uh, the Tether is not good, then a lot of Tether will come into the market to be sold for something that's more tangible, more valuable. That means any other deflationary coin, including Bitcoin and Bitcoin Cash, are gonna actually get more demand based on the lack of faith in items like Tether. So right now, as long as you can exchange your Tether for something else, I strongly advise you to actually exchange your Tether for something else. So the number one asset, of course, I would recommend is uh, Bitcoin Cash because it is exactly the same property as Bitcoin, but with way better utility than Bitcoin and the price at a fraction of Bitcoin. And therefore, if you do have some Tether, I do re strongly recommend you to get rid of your Tether and exchange your Tether, not for US dollar, it's not that much better than Tether, instead exchange it for uh, the new stable currency. So from my perspective, BTC and BCH both will become de facto stable currency in the future. But this will only happen when Bitcoin become a multi-trillion dollar asset class. And this moment we're just at this moment we are actually less than a trillion for BTC and of course next to nothing in BCH. But in the future, any deflationary coins, and there's only that few deflationary coins in the market that is universally accepted and is based on proof of work, any of those coins are gonna go up incredibly in value because it becomes de facto store of value. So instead people store the uh, medium exchange in case of Tether, they're gonna store this value in BTC and BCH. And the, um, uh, when that happens, you're gonna see the price for those stable coins, the new stable coins, so to speak, skyrocket. So they won't be that stable. Instead, what is really stable will be a demand for those stable coins. It's going to go up. So once we reach a multi-trillion dollar asset value, then the price will become similar to a Japanese yen or US dollar, where the day-to-day -day fluctuation should be less than 0.5%. But until that happens, Tether is not going to do the job. Instead, most people who hold Tether is going to change their Tether into something that they can use later and has tangible value and is not cannot be inflated away because right now what what obviously the issuers are doing with tether is that they're inflating away their own currency the more they print the tether the more likely it's going to be worth less than one us dollar the more likely people want to get rid of that currency so this is also known as grisham's law uh, a bad money chase out the good money which means the bad money, in this case is Tether, is get spent quicker than any other money. So you're going to see an increase actually in transaction in Tether volume, not decrease. This is my prediction, definitely. We'll see what happens. Uh, if you do have Tether, exchange that for your favorite coin of your choice. 
And personally, if I if I would have the tether, I definitely want to exchange all those, every single one of them for Bitcoin Cash. So that's my take on tether, and I don't think it's going to be a long term issue. But in the short term, definitely it's going to increase the volatility in the market. So you're going to see. From, from my perspective, 10 percent a day is literally just a normal day-to-day -day business until we reach a multi-trillion dollar asset value in Bitcoin and Bitcoin Cash. All right, see you in the next one. Bye.